Hey guys, so I wanted to start off this video uh, by sending a great, great big thank you to you guys. I love when you're leaving comments on these videos or sending me personal messages. It seriously makes it so worth it to keep doing them. And I love hearing your stories and sharing and what you guys are doing to stay healthy and kind of just reaching out to you guys. And I love, love, love connecting. So thank you so much. Today's video um, kind of relates to the video I filmed about um, getting rid of toxic people in your life, and it's about working on yourself. So I didn't want you guys to think that you just get rid of these bad people and then bam, your life is just fan-freaking-tastic and you don't have to do anything else. Um, part of that is taking the steps and the time and the effort to work on yourself, to make yourself be a better person. Um, you're not going to attract those good people into your life until you are exhibiting those uh, characteristics that you want to find in other people. And so I just wanted to share a couple of things that you can do uh, just to, inshallah, help you become a better person this month um, and later on after the month is over. Specifically for this month is to read some Quran. I mean, so much love, so much knowledge, so much, uh, so many miracles. I mean, that is the time for you to uh, plant those seeds and uh, research and, and learn from, you know, the religion itself on how to become that person uh, that people just want to be around and that um, truly is an inspiration and a, and a blessing to others. So I would definitely, I'm sure you're already doing this, but if you're not, uh, take the time to read a little bit a day. And I mean, the tips I'm giving you are tips I am trying to work on myself, so I'm not preaching here, but um, definitely take the time to read a little bit every day and add a small little tidbit of knowledge uh, to, your, uh, to your Islamic knowledge. Um, another thing is to evaluate your character. A lot of times we get in this mindset like, oh, if, if she doesn't like me, that's her problem. I am who I am. Nobody's going to change that. Sometimes, I mean, you do want to be proud of who you are and don't let people kind of mold you into something you're not. But remember that when people bring things up, it is a little a good idea to take a little bit of time to kind of Think about what they said. If you don't think it's true and you're absolutely 100% sure and you're like, that is totally not me, they just misunderstand, then great. I mean, you know who you are. But if there's some truth in their comment, you know, don't take offense and take the time to, you know, privately see what you can do about it, see how you can become a better person, improve on, on that specific comment. One of my favorite things to do is help others and this is the perfect month to do that. A lot of times we think helping others is giving is giving money or um, you know a donation, and although that is highly appreciated and definitely uh, worth the applaud, spending your time, which I feel is the most valuable valuable thing, um, is definitely something that you you can't really put words on. I mean, taking the time to help others, to learn from them, to hear people's stories, to volunteer um, is one of the best things you can do and one of the, my favorite things to do uh, to build my character and, you know, make me aware of things around me and people around me that, you know, we're all humans and we can definitely learn a thing or two from each other. So hopefully those tips help. I mean, definitely getting rid of the people who aren't contributing positivity and encouragement in your life, um, but also taking the time to work on yourself and becoming that person that you want to be. Um, and hopefully you can take some of these things later on after the month is over and, and can still apply them very, very well. All right, guys. I'll see you later. Bye.